Well, that same year you interviewed Khalees. Yes. And that was the first time she really talked about the whole Nas relationship and, and everything else like that. That yeah. was, a, I felt, an epic interview. I almost missed that interview. That was my first real interview. I, I mean, I've had interview. I mean, Floyd was a real interview and other things that went viral, but that was when I felt something in the interview because she had shared that she had been abused by Nas um, and she had alleged that they had an abusive relationship. And she made the connection to being in her home bruised and beaten like Rihanna. And when she said that, because it was so, I didn't even expect that to come out of her mouth. I felt the magnitude of what it was going to be because I don't believe she had ever talked about their relationship like that. Yeah. I mean, I'd interviewed uh, Nas's uh, baby mother mm. uh, and she told the whole story, but the Khalees part was always sort of an unknown mm -hmm. because you knew that they broke up right when she was pregnant, but you didn't really know where it went because Nas is very private and she was very private, but you mm -hmm. actually managed to, you know, pull out a lot of information in the interview. Yeah, and I mean, you know, I'm a huge Nas fan, yeah, you know, I mean, me Nas is an icon, you know, and so, you know, I, I never have had the privilege of interviewing him and I try to avoid him because I know that it stuck with him, you know, I yeah. saw when his rollout came after that, Billboard was like, what, okay, we get the album, but what about that? Like, you gonna talk about that? And so I know that that followed him for a while and I've been around him in rooms and in shows and concerts and stuff where I just don't go around. Not that I'm afraid of him at all. It's just I, I'm very uncomfortable because I do have a revere for him. But at the same time, I've got a job to do. And it was her interview to say what she needed to say. And I'm going to do another interview with her soon. And we just honored her at our award show, the Hollywood Impact Hollywood Unlock Impact Award. So, yeah, but I, I remember when she she called me that day, I was uh, actually on my way to Vegas. Floyd had sent his plane to pick us all up, me, Melissa, and everybody. And... Uh, I say, Khalees, I can't, I gotta go to Vegas. I'm gonna, she was like, if you don't come and do this interview, I'm gonna give it to TMZ. And I said, okay, and she, I'm frustrated with my baby dad. And I said, okay, well, I'll come. So we went to her backyard, set up the cameras, and she sat down and we talked and it was, and, and, it, and it allowed me to really develop my interview style too, because my interview style is, I want to disarm them and make them feel very connected, like you did me, <laughs> and then, and then ask them questions to get them in a place of comfort and then ask them the hard questions. and. Uh, I didn't see that hard question coming, but I could read her body language and tell that there was more there. And when I asked her if he hit her and she said, yeah, I used to beat it, I was like, well, it was wow.